Hi, I'm Rebecca, and I'm here at the Sanus Design Lab to show you how simple it is to mount your flat panel TV on the wall. With Sanus mounts, installation is a one, two, three step process. Let's get started. Yesterday, I went to Sanus.com and used the mount finder tool to match the correct mount for my screen. I simply entered the make and model of my TV into the tool and chose a mount from the list of compatible Sanus product results. I then found a local retailer using the store locator on Sanus.com and purchased my mount. I've also taken the time to use a stud finder and mark the location of the studs in my walls. Another great web tool from Sanus is the height finder. I knew that I wanted the top of my screen at 60 inches because I'll be watching this from my couch and I want the top of the screen at about eye level. This is the same rule of thumb for gaming, watching from your bed, etc. By using the height finder, I got the exact height of each hole that I'll need to drill out for installation. I'm now drilling the holes that I'm going to use to attach the wall plate to the wall. Now we're ready to begin the installation. Step one is to attach the monitor brackets to the TV using the included hardware. On all TVs, there are four holes on the back, and this is what you'll use to mount the brackets onto the TV. Use the diameter of bolts compatible with your TV. If you aren't sure which mounting holes to use, you can reference the television manual. There are a lot of different bolt lengths and spacers in the provided hardware bag. I want to choose a bolt length that isn't too long or too short. If there were any obstructions or if I need extra room for my cables or another bolt length, I can use the spacers that are included with the hardware. The spacers create extra room between the TV and the mount. Step number two is to install the wall plate onto the wall using the same holes we drilled earlier. Okay, now for the final step, I'm going to place the screen up on the wall plate and then engage the locking mechanism to secure it in place. At this point, you will also need to route all of your cables and connect them to your screen. Sanus has some innovative ways to easily hide your cables from view. You could use our model ELM805 power bridge to quickly run the cables behind the drywall. The power bridge has two parts. The first installs behind the screen and the second installs down at floor level where you can connect it to an existing outlet. The power bridge also includes space for your low voltage signal cables like HDMI. Another easy way to hide your cables is to use the paintable white cable tunnels made by Sanus. They attach directly to the drywall and include a variety of corner pieces. You can paint them to match your wall and make your cables invisible. That's it, as easy as one, two, three. Now I'm ready to enjoy my newly mounted flat panel TV. This is Rebecca with more innovative AV solutions from Sanus.